So today we're going to be using the chemical pH test kits to test the pH of our water. Uh, we will be requiring a pipette itself to take a sample of the water, one of the three kits available to test the pH and the water itself. So first of all we're going to take the tube, take a sample of the water we want to test it approximately three quarters full. Then, using the indicator, apply one to two drops, approximately a bit more. And then close that, and then shake it up. And once it's turned colour, we then apply it. To the chart under white light, natural light, and decide which of the colours provided it is. So that looks like it's uh, approximately pH 6, which is adequate for what we require at the moment. We can add nutrients and then test it again. So what we're going to do is we're going to cheat a little bit, and I'm going to apply a small amount of pH up, just to give you an example of it being too high. So we're going to apply Approximately a mil of pH up, which is extremely high for this requirement. Let's see how high it goes. So again, repeat the process. Empty the tube out completely, so there's nothing in it. Apply a sample of the water into the tube, and instantly, so there's a slight amount of residue. Let's find a different colour, so we'll apply a little bit more. Drop of the indicator as required. Drop. In there, pick it up, and voila! Magic! Now, obviously, that compared to the chart is extremely high, so that is pH 11. So, you'd apply pH down and repeat the process until it came down either to an approximately 7 within 6.5 or 6.7. And that is how you use pH chemical test kits.